Hi guys, it's me again for news for the 20th of December 2018 and yeah, here we go with the news for the day. Starting off from BBC News UK on Twitter as usual. Scotland's wildcats on brink of extinction in wild reveals DNA study. Check out this personal trainer who is paralysed from the armpits down doing some para some pull-ups. Robert Caramani is calling for gyms to be more inclusive for people with disabilities. The armpits essentially being from like here, here like so it was essentially paralysed from like here down. Don't live day to day. I live hour to hour, broken by benefits. Life in one of the town's hardest hit by the UK welfare funds. Centrina, legal in legal challenge. Centrica, late in legal challenge to energy price cap. Ole Gunnar Solskjaer, Manchester United boss will get players and will get players enjoying football again. Putin voters choice of. Trump and Brexit disrespected. Westminster attack Parliament gates needed to be constantly armed. German Air Force on alert, amid, um, alert, on alert amid spying reports at Stuttgart. At Wick Airport, army called in amid drone chaos. And I think there's like one or two drones flying over Gatwick just after I kind of finished yesterday's news. Well, that's we mispronounced in 2018. It was probably a lot. Including for myself. <laughs> Second jar death pr prompts inquiry into Manchester care home. US boy meets scientist Martin Podiakoff in Nottingham. Macaulay Culkin recreates some of the Christmas movie's most fam famous scenes from Home Alone. US charges China government hackers. She must enact the will of the people, otherwise, it's not a referendum at all. Vladimir Putin's advice on the UK to read Prime Minister Theresa May on Brexit. <coughs> Can I just say, I might actually agree with that bit. <laughs> As we kind of elected the Conservatives into power, they should be doing what? Should be listening and all that. Police in ongoing discussion with army about drones causing destruction at Gatswick Airport, Ministry of Defence says. There are chan ch chances over the next few days of seeing now create some other pearl clouds. But well, the best chance starts from Sunday and goes all the all goes into Tuesday around Tuesday, Wednesday. And Boris Arsenal say they have identified the individual who threw a bottle at Delhi Ali. Banker guilty of murdering sex worker with a pe pestle. P E S T L E. Basically, the bank killed a sex worker, okay? Marco murders. He arrested over bestial tourist killings. Children's toys, the backlash against pink and blue branding. Airline sources sells BC that flights at to and from Gatwick Airport are currently cancelled until so at least 7 pm. Hopefully it's okay now being about 25 past 9 at, in the evening at the time of this recording. Dark storm clouds over Sydney Opera House and Sydney Harbour Bridge today.
Rosalie Prophetic Kiev Christmas Tree Divide Social Media UK Prime Minister Theresa May speaks Polish as she tells Britain Britain's polls you can stay in we want you to stay after Brexit. Several Sarah Well Green case please make murder arrest. Russia news channel RT broke TV impar impartiality rules off says. UK interest rates kept on hold at 0.75% by Bank of England. Ho ho ho, hi, Merry Christmas, Barack Obama pays a surprise visit, visit to staff, patients and their parents at a children's hospital in Washington DC. Theresa May's Brexit bill will be brought back to the Commons on Wednesday the 9th of January 2019. PDC World Darts Championship James Wade apologises for behaviour. Homeless deaths, it's, it is simply unacceptable to see lives cut short this way. Community Secretary James Brokenshire says we have a moral duty to act after first official estimates suggest nearly 600 deaths last year. Now for homeless people and all that. As uh, ho homeless man that collapsed outside houses of parliament is since died. Fortnite sued over sued over the floss. Can you trademark a dance move? Japan to leave a whaling commission to resume hunting. Homeless people's deaths up twenty four percent over five years. Steve Smith has appeared in a very fair in Australia advert in a bid to spread awareness about mental health for young Australians. Andrea Ledsom and Amber Rudd suggest reveal Brexit Plan B's. UK high streets have twice as many shops as needed. Fortnite teen hackers are earning thousands of pounds a week. Chris Evans says yes to Strictly Come Dancing in 2019. So yeah, I may see Chris Evans next year on Strictly. In all testing, US Senate's bail seeks an end to kitten research deaths. Premier League schedule look close as the toughest for festive fixtures. Single mum says the picture of Prince Harry and William and Kate and Meghan has made her £40,000 so far. It's Trump's severe withdrawal plan stuns allies. She controlled my money and when I could eat. What's the UN Global Compact on Migration? Ali Ali, Tottenham player hit on the head by battle drawing Carabao Cup tie with Arsenal. Fraudulent charity runners condemned. A Christmas present that could tear your family apart. Listed buildings, bus shelter and cattle troll get listed status. Girlsford falls Paddy Armstrong in plea to pub bomb car. Runner. Braun Taylor, ladies European to our birdie. Record, record broken, broken in Morocco. PDC World Darts Championship, James Wade says he did it for the UK and win over Sierra Asada. Premiership Rugby, minority shareholding saw to CVC, capital partners for 200 million pounds.
Your many mum arrives in the US to visit dying son in California. Jose Mourinho not making comments on Manchester United sacking. Celtic win against Motherwell 3 0. No first half goals in Shaw Host top Scottish Premiership. And Tottenham win against Arsenal 2 0. Why pantomimes deserve more respect? Holland vital safety checks. Fire safety checks. Watchdog finds. Game of Thrones star producer paranoia caused problems. Sydney sea plane crash. Passengers photo gives clues to final moments. Third of rare Scotch Scotch wish the Scotch whiskies. Tested, found to be fake, which makes those re the ones I actually real even rarer. Born against volcano tourism risks. Social Asian traits when memes are come a diaspora phenomenon. Dutch girl shot down Rotterdam school bike show. Brexit referendum plausible if MPs can't decide. Says Amber. Flights at Gatwick, halted and made with lots of flying drone in area. And yeah, moving on to BBC News World. Democratic Republic of Recon Congo presidential election postponed for a week. Most withdrawal from Syria leaves Kurds backed into a corner. Jazz guitarist Musa Manzini plays through brain surgery. Sorry, I am hoping it's just the idea. New sinkhole opens up in Monarchan. Hungry President signs controversial slave law. German airports had that one. No deal bugs that could see Alaman face fruit shortage. shortages. Irish President signs bill legislating legalising abortion. New York police, New York police, bill innocent man, four thousand six hundred dollar for rectal probe. You shouldn't be doing that. Egyptian court acquits forty three NGO workers for foreign funding case. In a foreign funding case, disoriented birds found dead in Saint Helier. Chinese hackers linked in Beijing, linked to Beijing government. Brexit Leo Varadkar warns against UK customs changes. Vandalism at Thailand Man Beauty Spot condemned. Albania expels Iran envoy in terror row. Trump supporters and gases retreat on board border wall. Jews bank sorry for calling police on black man cashing paycheck. Why are Kashmiris sharing faces of traditional dress? Army bomb experts at Dublin family courts. Inside the palace of a dictator now lying in ruin. US Senate passes anti lynching law. After Senate vote. Uganda President says Miss World Africa should flaunt natural hair. Surprise and triumph in Mideast media over US withdrawal. Man National Stadium closed on safety grounds after gales. US Syria port harms anti IS fighters. I haven't actually heard much good from Trump's presidency at the moment. Let's 
Irish Gun, Stark, No Deal, Brexit Plan, Unveil. PewDiePie in the T series, The Battle to Be King of YouTube. Crown Dependencies to Try to Shake Off EU Tax Haven Tax. Keeping baseball players allowed in MLB without defecting. Learning war card squeezed by superpowers in Hawaii dispute. River jailing Brazil judge ruling offers hope to ex president. Yeah, that is the end of the news. And could have got a dash in general pull all out in twenty nineteen. And radio host catches his suicidal call online until help to arrive. I suppose in that situation that's kind of like the best thing to do. And yeah, that is the uh, news for the day. And I will see, hopefully see you all tomorrow. May or may not do tomorrow considering I'm in Birmingham tomorrow. So yeah. I may see you tomorrow, so yeah. Bye. Bye for now.